Alrighty, everyone. Welcome to our final part of Retro React Dark Souls 1 for tonight. And then next time around, we're going to finish it up. But let's continue with the Blight Town. The Blight Town experience, baby. Here we oh, go. Oh, man, this is it's fucking stupid. This far into the game, and, and I mean, I just leveled up. Think about this. I just leveled up five times. Five times I leveled up my endurance. That's right. And I still died at two hits. And now you're going like, to get five the times fuck? the deaths. That's how it works. Five levels up, five times the deaths. so stupid. Really. A game where you die almost instantly to every monster in the game. Come the fuck <laughs> on. Come on, it's fun. Blah, 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 chow, blight chow. <laughs> you know, they did a poll once. They said, would you prefer to sit... They said, would you prefer, prefer to sit ass first onto a cactus, shoving it straight up your bunghole, or would you like to play Blight Town again on the PS3? 90% of people actually vote for the cactus. It doesn't matter, I have no money, but... Nope. He does not. <clears throat> no poison curing items there. Despair? <laughs> Weary of strong poisons. No shit. The best part is this is I just the entrance. Who gets it for the first time down here knows that. This is the easy part of Blight Town that's kicking my ass right now. Good luck. You'll need it. Good luck. This game's full of shit. Try lying in ambush. I could not. I couldn't oh move. my I was like god. Stuck in place, dude. Oh I, my I, lord. I, it, it didn't even make sense. I'm about to die. Here it comes. Right now. Whatever. I guess I gotta lock on. I'm gonna have to lock. That's what I should have been doing. Locking on. So I can just strafe around them. Alright, I'll that's try right. that. That's right. That's what you need back. to do, Dark Side Phil. Again. All right, let's fucking get through this part. Get back down to him again. It's fucking annoying watching me do it again. All right, here we go. Here we go. Blah 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 blah. White town. White white town. <laughs> you got like confused. Ooh. Uh, bye bye. Nothing I can do there. Oh uh, no! Uh, he went crotch oh, first. Me. <laughs> He went said, oh, crotch first onto job. the beam, Suicide, bitch. Woo! popped Body both splash. of his testicles, <laughs> died, and then the guy fell yes. down next to me. Very nice. Well, this is going to be bullshit. This is gonna be the double testes tumble, they call it. <laughs> the testicular tumble. Ooh. Relax. It's pretty much your standard. You have a dodge, you have a heavy attack, light attack, projectiles, healing, you know. Most dungeon crawlers have all this. <laughs> So really, this game's selling point is to be fucking hard. Jordan, we didn't lose can, like, Stardew. Stardew to is tomorrow night. I don't know what you're talking it. about. Or me, like, you know, I would love to... Oh, I one-shotted the Capra Demon. But I really don't care that I did. I didn't... I, I, just for everyone to know, I didn't cheat or anything. People have been saying, oh, that's because Phil looked it up and all that. I actually didn't look anything up for the Capra Demon at all. I just ran in there and fought the fucker. And ended up beating him fairly quickly. Staggered. Staggered him. There you go. But, uh, you know, again, I'm not the kind of person. I'm not going to go around. Oh, I one shot at the Capra Demon. I'm amazing. Everyone should kiss my ass. Like, I don't care. <laughs> like I said, or like I said earlier, like I said in the channel update video I made about this game, this game isn't a competition. I'm not competing with anyone to beat this game. So, I don't really care. If I'm able to do things easily or any more easily or more difficult than anybody else. I think it's kind of silly that people treat this game like that, like it's a fucking crazy competition. Yep. Wow. They still do to this day. Okay, were you burping? Is that a burp? I think he's standing there, he's standing there burping at me. No, he's, that's, his, that's his singing oh, voice. He's singing, Blood Town, the Blood Town Experience. Only to his native tongue. But it sounds very different. 
Alright, I gotta back off till I get more stamina. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, I couldn't get any stamina. That's good. Let me get paws on. I got him. Here we go. There we go. Fuck, man. This is retarded. <laughs> How many more of these are there? I see one. I'm hoping there's only like one or two more. Oh, fuckers. yeah, there's only one or two more. Don't worry. Nothing else in Blight Town. Completely empty. Come on. I see normal enemies behind them, those normal zombies. What the hell are these guys Why even called? Fuck? Come over here. Wonder what they're actually called, these enemy type. Fucking shithead. You big fat butters looking motherfucker. Come on. Come get me. <laughs> what did you call me? My mother called me a special snowflake. Now I come and pass it on to you. <laughs> Let me show you the gifts of my family heritage. I call this club the Thwacker. <laughs> Handed down here. from my grandpappy. What? He didn't even hit me. You saw how far away I was? I was so far <laughs> away and he fucking hit me from a hundred miles away. That's another complaint I have. Like, they purposely give every enemy insane reach. Oh, yes. And yes. every enemy can attack so through walls, but you can't. Way further away than you can fucking hit it. So obviously you're at a monstrous disadvantage in every single fight in the game. Like, come on, man. Yep. What's up, Jay Stan? Good evening. How you doing, man? Thanks for stopping by. We're in the finale of tonight, and the next week we actually finish the playthrough. Not the game, the playthrough. So here they come. Here come my favorite enemies. Oh, here it comes. Look at this. Can I get out of this guy's reach, please? Thank you. That was fair. He has an attack where he can bite the nice. fuck out of you. That does, no, I keep, again, I keep telling you guys there's no why am I toxic part in this playthrough. It's the second run where I say that. From one fucking bite? Come on, man. Fuck that shit around. The block down experience, yeah. Dude walking around here. Oh, this guy spits at you, huh? Yeah, blow darts. I can't the fucking see him. Blow darts. It's so dark here, I can barely see this guy. Uh-oh. Now I'm toxic. And toxic is even worse than being poisoned. Oh, and I'm dead. I had no idea that guy even existed because he was off screen. He was off screen, runs up and bites me from behind and kills me instantly. I got hit by one guy with one dart that he shot at me. Instant toxification, which according yeah. to my stat or the, the item I had says that toxi toxin is actually stronger than poison. That's because it is. <laughs> PS3 troops that the big guys are called infested barbarians. Oh. This is stupid. This, this isn't even the worst part. We're not even in the bad part of Blight Town yet. Uh, We're not. Well, this might be the part I never beat, honestly. Because if I have to keep doing this over and over for two hours, I don't think I'm going to want to play this game anymore. I'm just being uh, honest. Like, Dark, Dark Gullbox, I love that this is just a black void on video it, records so poorly. Yeah, oh, I know. I've 7,000 times until somehow I look out and don't get poisoned or toxin. It's That's not fun to me, you know? And that's the point where you have to say, no moss. No, no moss. moss. No moss from software. No moss. You don't deserve any more game time. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see. If I can get past it, I can get past it. <laughs> that ladder animation. Some guy died right there? What the fuck? How do you die there? He must have walked off the edge. Hey, look, it's my buddy. <laughs> my, my buddy. My buddy. My buddy. Wherever I go, he's gonna go. My buddy. Look out. Flamma Jam. I gotta back off and get stamina. I can't. I was locked in place.
Oh. Ah, getting better at these fights. No, Darth Golbach, we're not at the part with bad frame rate yet. I'm emphasizing to you, this is this is normal. The bad frame rate is coming. It's worse than what you're seeing right now. I'm serious. What? I had him fucking targeted, and then he it, it, the game untargeted him. Here we go. I gotta pull him back so I don't pull the other one. Come on, asshole. That's right, Slayer. That's a the my buddy I just sang is an old retro ad song. They sold these dolls that were supposed to be like companion dolls for people who didn't have brothers or sisters so one was called my buddy it was supposed to be like your best Damn friend if you're a boy the other one was called kid sister for girls who didn't have sisters but wanted one and they were like surrogate you know your surrogate imaginary friend but it was a doll kind of like the okay, cabbage patch kid there's a like cabbage patch kid it was kind of a similar cabbage. premise asshole that was a poor choice That's right, then Chucky came out, and no one wanted my buddy or kid sister ever again. That's correct. Because that's actually what Chucky was based off of. Chucky was supposed to be a hybrid of, like, the idea of Cabbage Patch Kids and my buddy. Come on, you fuck. I'm all dead away for your fat ass. Look out. You can backstab these guys, right? I'm pretty positive you can. You just go right behind them while locked on and stab them at insane damage. The thing is, I don't even think I know how to backstab right, in this. Better. I'm pretty sure I don't. Only I hit once, killing three of them. Dung pie. I wonder, can I just fucking try to drop down over here and skip some of those guys? You can, but you don't skip it. Onto this area right there. You can run and jump there, probably and then there's not, items down die, there, but then but... you still gotta fight those guys anyway, I think. I could try. And then way I can fight my way up from there rather than have to worry about that fucking guy with, that was sniping. <laughs> yep. Oh, no! <laughs> you fucking assholes. They purposely put that there. It looks like you can land on it perfectly. And as soon as I go to do it, the game clips. It does a clipping motion with the hitboxes and puts me right in the fucking pit. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. See, that's what I mean. That's what I'm talking about when I'm talking about Miyazaki's response. Hmm? Gonna walk on it. Gonna walk on it. He's gonna try it. Uh? 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 Oh! <laughs> I got him. I got him. I fucking got him. Oh my god, these fucking guys, man. There's a wild dev team, I'm man. About the inconsistency <laughs> of this game, okay? Now, if you remember, when I was going to the giant crow's nest, how implausible it looked like that I could actually jump or roll onto that narrow ledge that led up to the crow's nest. But every time I did it, it worked absolutely perfectly. And <laughs> that piece of wood right there that I just died trying to jump onto didn't look any less implausible than the ledge for the giant crow's nest. So, again, in one situation, the game rewards you for doing something like that. In another situation, you get completely fucked. It's completely inconsistent. If it's the same size ledge, in this case, it was even closer than the one that I ran and jumped on to get to the crow's nest, why the fuck couldn't I land on that? And all the answer is because the game is inconsistent. It's purposely inconsistent to fuck with you and make it more difficult. They laugh at you. Ha <laughs> ha. That foolish player. Thank you for uploading your fail. I got a good laugh out of that tonight, said Miyazaki. Holy shit. Miyazaki's like, I haven't seen a movie or TV show ever since the release of Demon's Souls. I just watch people play like the games on YouTube games and good. laugh at fails. <laughs> And you're Free entertainment for, for life. You know how pissed you'd probably be? You'd be? Like, what the fuck did I do? What did I buy here? It's not even a game. It's a fucking torture, torture rack. <laughs> you know that boss bed of chaos that I put into Dark Souls 1 that's functionally broken? I don't call it bed of chaos. I call it the laugh riot. Ooh! <laughs> <clears throat> Attack innovation. 
That was a different two hit animation. Oh my goodness. One, so I didn't know he could attack again like that. Hey, at least they give me. They put my souls here. They're nice enough to put them there where I jumped <laughs> off like an idiot. You know the Radon Festival boss fight everyone had problems with in Elden Ring? Guess what I'd call that? The Lands Between Comedy Club. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's a two hit. Look how far away I was, and he still was able to hit me. Look how far away I am now, and he's still able to hit me. Are you kidding me, man? Fucking there we nonsense. go. Will I ever get past these guys? Has it so not been 30 minutes, and I'm still fighting the same enemies? As he swings. <laughs> That's right, it's a big club, box. but he needs that amount, uh, amount of, of ground space for the amount of deaths and laughs. I'm trying this again. You can do this. You can totally do this. You have oh, to you run and jump. You really can't do it. It really is. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we fell mad. What the hell is that? You fell so too. He jumped after me. What are they? They're so desperate to fucking get, uh, get their hands on me, they fucking kill themselves? Holy crap, man. Oh my god, dude. We're not going to get very far tonight. We only have 10 minutes left. We're not going to get very far. Look. There you go. Fuck you. Oh my god. No, there is jumping, but the jumping is wonky. So, they may, they may jump the same button as run. So, in order to jump in the game, you have to get a running start by holding it. Then you have to release and press again. You can't just jump like you can in Elden Ring. You actually have to run, release, and press again. So if you don't have a running start, you basically can never jump in this game. Yeah, I'm going to train it down there again, but this time I'm going to run and jump. Come here, butters. Slam a jam. Me, boy. Okay. You hit me from 700 miles away that time. You changed the jump button? I don't think you can in this original uh, version on PS3. I'm almost positive you up. can't change that stuff. I think that was added later for other versions. So now what do I do? Now I'm pretty fucked. I might as well just kill myself. Oh, there you go. That does cure poison. All right. I do have an item that cures poison. That's nice. What's funny is I totally just did that, and you know I'm just going to jump and kill myself, completely negating the poison, Supposedly so I wasted that item. Too. Like, there was no point to be using that item if I was going to try this Maybe jump try anyway. To run and jump. I, I think you can run and jump across. Really I think you can I'm do it. I'm afraid the fall's going to hurt me so much that those guys are going to fuck me up when I land. Can I fucking bow and arrow this asshole? Now I'm going to waste arrows, too. Great. Missed? What's going on? He ran away. He was oh. pissed off. I oh, no, you know what? He's gonna run all the way over here and fight me, isn't he? I see him moving. I think he's climbing all the way yeah, over look. here to fight me. He's climbing up the ladder and everything. Look at this guy. Yeah, look, he's climbing up a giant fucking ladder. Where's he going? He climbed up a giant ladder. Look at this. Running. Yeah, he's running over here. He's so angry. Then I shot him with a fucking crossbow. He's actually going to run all the way over here to fight me. Look at this. That's actually a pretty big dedication, no? Crazy. No, he gave up. All right, good. Fuck you. Oh, <laughs> no! The beam got in my way. The I hit the beam. My way. The oh, beam my God. God. I, I hit the beam. To completely fuck any chance of you actually landing down there and skipping these monsters. Huh. Wow. Well, fuck that. I guess I'll do it the regular way. Actually, ew, Oh my god. Good. I guess I'll actually have to fight these guys. They'll we'll probably end after one. this part ends in a couple minutes. Do, wow. Looks like I have to. Wow. Land right on the beam. 
I'm just wasting my time playing <laughs> this game. <laughs> So you know I'm gonna die, because I only have what, a minute left? So you know I'm dying again. Just just get used to it. I'm gonna die right away. Here it comes. What's up, Gabriel? Good evening. Is there anything on the other side? I'm just curious. Anything over here? No, the return to Dark Souls videos are from when I did direct capture, so they wouldn't be considered valid for Sword my throwback game. events. These are all the cat camera. Oh, stuff that we're watching here we still have another five years of footage to get through before we get to that stuff my friend oh well, i just wanted to check being thorough <laughs> this bear. Uh -huh. imminent strong poison strong poison All right, I'm about to die. Come on. Oh, I don't even get to do it. Oh, that's the end of the video part. All right. All right, take 27. Here we go. Yep. All right, so remember, oh. next week, we will start on part 58. We've got, I'm pretty sure it's 66 parts. Let's find out. It's 65 parts and then the review. So next week, we will finish. The retro re uh, react to Dark Souls 1 and the big rage quit. And uh, and then we'll watch probably some of my review that I did of the game, even though I never beat it. So, guys, thank you. This was a great evening. I had a great time. A lot of laughs and a lot of fails and a lot of cringe. Right? Next time around, we wrap this up. And you know what's funny? I'm going to beat the Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth Tree DLC this week. So it all coincides. I beat that and then we finish this. All right. Thank you all. I hope you all enjoyed. See you next time for the conclusion.